this is how I change my waters from my beta fish tank. I'm just doing a partial change for today, and next week will be the full tank change. Here's what I do. A since I already started here, I, I took the video late. I grab the water and by this mason jar, tiny mason jar. I put it in tiny. Uh, in the Philippines, we call this pitchel, but I don't know what's this in English. We call it pitchel. I just take this one up like that. Actually, beneath this um, roof, hierro. There's actually a you know, let me turn off the flash. You can see there's a holder that is this is a temporary bedroom, so this is just a temporary cover. There's a holder that leads to the ground. We're cemented here, and in, in the outside is dirt. So, what I'll do is just pour it like this. Then that leads to the ground. I don't have to go outside. More on a lazy version of lazy version of this. I know a uh, lazy version of going outside and going back inside my room or like going to the sink. And now I since I can't since I'm holding the camera, I don't want them to get subtle with the. Getting dizzy from the water current, so I'm just pouring this carefully. By the way, this in this gallon is a stock water for more than two weeks now. There we go. I'm subtle with the pouring the water so that the fishes won't get dizzy or something. As you can see, I have a marker there to tell me where the water level should be. It's like a reminder. I think this is a one gallon tank. I didn't measure it yet. How big is it? Since the this big one. Nakimi always attacking so some are you so I'm finding another plant uh, I have a plant farm there in the in the outside I will add another plant so that he, she can hide let's put this below this, this used to be below I guess buried it in the bedrock there we go and I'll be adding more later and let's do a time lapse
Here we go, mate.